With the, with the first day of spring less than two weeks away, it's a great time to start incorporating some fresh spring veggies into your everyday dishes. Here with some tasty ideas is Chef Stefan Brichel from Max's Wine Dive Fort Worth. Yes, Fort Worth. And I just visited Max's for the first time myself in Uptown. Okay, over Patrick's I'm a big spot. fan. Yeah. I'm a big fan. You have some really cool stuff Must over there. Must have the Brussels sprouts. Yes, the chicken fried <laughs> Brussels sprouts are, they're like crack. You gotta, gotta keep that. Perfect them. work. It, it is crack for your body. It healthy is. crack, healthy crack. Awesome. Well, what are we making today? Uh, we're gonna do a little crispy uh, pan seared redfish over an heirloom tomato and fennel salad with the preserved lemon vinaigrette. And so it's fish really bright. Friday. Fish Friday. Fish Friday. It's perfect. Absolutely. Uh, the redfish is a little bit gamier, so a little bit more rich, more robust fish. Uh, mm -hmm. Plays really well with the acidity of the fresh tomato, mm. and then the fennel, and then the uh, preserved lemon vinaigrette really well too. So it just kind of really cuts through that richness and is really clean. Okay, well tell us how you would prepare this. All right, so basically you're gonna take the skin side down on the fish four minutes, keep it down. Uh, that keeps the skin crispy, and then what we'll do is we'll flip it and finish it two more, two minutes more. Mm -hmm. It won't stick, and it sticks on us just a little That's bit. That's okay. We'll be all right. we, we can just scrape those crunchies yeah, we'll be off, okay. you know, and we just put them back exactly. on top. Exactly. So we'll let that finish a couple minutes, and basically we're going to take our tomatoes into a bowl with our thinly shaved fennel. What kind of tomatoes did you say? Uh, you these were are heirloom tomatoes, so okay. uh, you can get them at your local farmer's market. Really yes, stuff. Which they're finally looking good again. Yeah, they're awesome. <laughs> really, really good. You should always smell your tomatoes. You smell like a tomato. If really? that makes sense. I never smell my tomatoes. You should always smell a tomato. Can I smell this one? Yeah, go for it. Hmm. You should smell vine ripened. <sighs> like as opposed to like grocery store tomatoes. Smells like grandma's tomatoes. farm. There you go, exactly. That smells like the best kind. So two ounces of the preserved lemon vinaigrette, which is just a little bit of preserved lemon rind, uh, shallot, Dijon mustard, olive oil, and a little bit of white wine champagne vinegar. Uh, we just toss that very lightly. This is so simple. Really quick, the plate. Just put it right in the middle. So healthy. Yes, very, very light, very little fat at all, and perfect for springtime. Absolutely. As well as Lent. So ready for spring. This is a perfect dish. All right. So we'll take this, take the fish. Come on, don't and stick. you said two minutes on the opposite side. Yes, ma'am. The so skin would be four minutes down, mm -hmm. opposite side, two minutes down. Correct. Good tip. All right. We'll plate that right there. Are we going to scrape those yummies off? We can. Good. If they want to come off this pan, we'll be all right. <laughs> oh, I like the crunchies on the bottom. Yeah, you know, those are good. the best ones. Oh, that sounds awesome. All right, we'll just throw that right okay, there on top. Okay, perfect. How beautiful. And just garnish a little bit of fennel frond right on top of it. Mm-hmm. Be good to go. So it's super simple, really nice and clean for uh, Lent. Like yeah, I said, absolutely. springtime as well. Uh, just really light. I have a friend that observe, observes Lent, and so she's going to love this. Yeah, we have a lot of different uh, fish options on the menu. Uh, over at Max's. Have especially. you changed the menu at all for uh, the spring? We just rolled out new spring menu Did on you? Wednesday. Ah. So there's um, about 90% gluten free as well. So it really kind of helps out for those people that are uh, celiac or take that lifestyle. Did you do that of chicken fried steak gluten free? Uh, I don't have the chicken fried steak at my store, but we do chicken fried chicken. Oh my gosh. Can't go wrong with that. And you're not taking those Brussels sprouts off the menu. Please no, tell me. No, can't take the Brussels sprouts what off the, the menu. I haven't been for brunch. What's the brunch menu uh, like? Brunch menu. We've got some new stuff. We have a uh, roasted chili relleno. So instead of being mm. fried, it's going to be a little bit lighter. Mm -hmm. uh, stuff with goat cheese, local uh, farm fresh eggs, house made chorizo. And then the big hitter right now is going to be the dream sickle French toast. Dream sickle? Yeah. Tastes like a Flintstone push up pop. Really? Yeah. What, what, what's on that? So toast? it's an orange vanilla syrup and orange vanilla custard, and then we do an amaretto mascarpone cream. Oh. So it's like the best cream cheese icing you can ever we gotta have. we got to go for brunch. Yeah, that you sounds have to. Fantastic. It's really, really good. It runs uh, 10 to 3 Saturday and Sunday. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Thank you so much. You Will you come back on. and make that French toast for us? Yeah, come on. We'll do like, it. Like uh, Monday? Yeah, I can do it Monday. <laughs> I can do it tomorrow if you want. <laughs> no, I won't be here tomorrow. But oh, I won't so be Monday, here Monday. So you got to make yeah. sure you get some. You, yeah, well, of course. Okay, well, I'm just asking. <laughs> thank no you worries. so much, oh, Stefan. I appreciate it. For the recipes made here today, log on to thebroadcasttv.com. Click on today's links. All right, when we come back, we're talking spring fashion, but for the man in your life, great looks for your guy when the broadcast returns. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah,